Welcome back everybody and this time we have two bags in front of us and this is because we are going to compare the outlet bag versus the retail bag. We get asked this a lot um, and we're going to go over the details of both of these bags. They're very much similar in design, um, similar in size. The retail bag looks a little bit smaller because it's 19. but we'll dive right into the details uh, and differences between the outlet bag versus the retail bag all right so now we're going to get into the details and see the differences between these two right again we have here the cassie crossbody 19 from the retail store with the top handle and the next one is the Marley Top Handle Satchel in Signature Chambray from the Outlet Store. And these both retail about more than 300 US dollars. Um, the Cassie is 375 Canadian. So yeah, it's, a, it's, a, it's above 300 US dollars. And for the Marley top handle is 350 US dollars. That's their retail price. And of course, in the outlet store, they always have it at a discount. For the coach retail, um, it is very rare that they'll put it on a, on a discount. So it comes with a dust bag and a fancy envelope for your receipt and a return. And it also has a return label there. These were both um, purchased from online. So what comes with the outlet version is that it will go into a plastic. It's like a factory coach plastic bag with the code on it, um, while the retail does not. Okay, taking a closer look at it, this is a coded canvas with the CC, uh, CC signature, it's the coach signature on it. It comes with a top handle that's removable and you have your chain, which is in a brass hardware. It's a bit weighty, but not too much. Then you also have your adjustable leather strap that also is in the refined calf leather. Now, um, for the Marley top handle, let's take a look. The top handle part of it is structured, so you can't really move it around much. It's very hard. And then the leather strap on it is also adjustable and removable. So the top handle part of this bag is not removable. And actually the leather part looks very much reminiscent to Louis Vuitton's Vachetta, um, if you're familiar with that. Now, taking a closer look again, so as I mentioned, it's structured. There's like, it feels like there's something inside. It's hard, it's stiff, but the quality of it is very similar. I can tell like from the leather, it's not as refined as the retail version, but it's still good quality. Like it's, there's nothing bad about this bag. It, I feel, like the leather is just a little bit different and looking closely this is also in a brass hardware they engrave coach on each side of those rings i hope that you can see it there and also um this also has a turn lock which also has the engraved coach logo on it so the compartments is also a little bit different from from the retail version and we're gonna take a look at that right now so for this one like the leather is so much softer it is very much like I, I feel that it is very much refined it's softer it is very similar there is a slight difference in the quality but I feel like the the retail version of the leather will age better and it will look better through time. I also feel that this the top handle part of it, uh, for the retail, it will be more comfortable. 
on your shoulder or your arm than the outlet version. Now, looking at the Coach Fob, um, the difference is in size. Uh, the retail version is a little bit larger, but again, the quality is very much the same. The logo is larger for the retail version. Um, looking at the sides of these now we'll we'll take a look at the hardware for the outlet first this does come in a, a golder tint compared to um the retail the retail has a more brass color and it does have the coach logo stamped or engraved um and there it, it's in two places here at the bottom of this toggle and also uh at the toggle of the lobster clasp. Now they also have it on the rings. There is a coach engraved there. I hope you can see it. Um, they almost always have this on all of the bags. And looking at the retail, I'm just gonna put this on the side. Looking at the retail version, Let's take one out. Let's start with the chain. So it does have the coach stamp or engraving on, on the toggle as well, but it's a little bit different and it has like a black ink to it. It does look a little bit more elegant and classy this way, in my opinion. And also because the brass is not so shiny, um, it's not like in your face kind of gold, gold color. Uh, I do prefer this type of finishing and I'm just gonna remove the top handle part of it and see if they do have the engraving on the rings as well okay now taking a closer look the bag does have the the stamping or engraving as well and it also has that black ink on it and it has the rivets on the side that also has the coach logo engraved, stamped on it. Now, I've, I don't see this a lot. In fact, I've never seen it much on the outlet bags at all. And I think that's one of the main differences that you can see aside from like the quality of the leather that, that's being used. Okay, now taking a look at the turn lock, I did mention that there is a coach um, logo and also it has New York at the bottom and that is being engraved on the turn lock. And when we open the bag, we'll see the quality of this bag. I'm trying to get in really close here so we can see the quality of um, the signature chambray now the needling on this is actually really impressive it looks more i mean i've seen the jacquard version of of the coach bags before and i think this one is actually sturdier it feels like it's gonna last longer um now also differencing in color the the retail version is more muted than it is for the outlet the outlet is more bright like you can see cc better than the retail version now this is in a coated canvas and we can't really compare the two materials but the coated canvas does feel a lot more like it like it will stand through time like the longevity of it and also in the turn lock there is a coach, another coach logo that you can see there on the turn lock, which was not on the out outlet version. But yeah, like the stitching, the quality of the stitching, I think is very much similar to the outlet version. I don't think there's a big difference there. You can tell that the quality of coach um, is really in the detail of how they make their bags. Now, looking on the inside of this, 
for the outlet version the the lining is like a micro suede i don't know if this is cheaper than a than a fabric lining because um it doesn't seem like so but yeah and the compartments on the inside there's only really one compartment for this bag so i guess that's where the difference is in material and they use a plastic zipper on the inside that has a leather pull right and it looks like it's a ykk zipper which is common among designer brands it's not a bad thing at all um, a lot of designers use that then you have your coach creed um, that has your style number on there okay um, at the back portion of it um, it has that slip pocket where that is also available on the retail version and on the retail version you can see there is a tiny coach on the left hand side um, on canvas this is quite common for the canvas material they do this a lot um, not so much on the on the fabric kind of material they normally wouldn't put coach somewhere on there um, but yeah i think material wise if you were to choose between a fabric or a coated canvas i would definitely go with a coated canvas now on the inside of this on the inside the lining is actually a fabric lining i don't know if this is even more expensive than um, a micro suede i would like to think the micro suede is actually more expensive but in the inside this has three compartments so it's kind of like an accordion type so you have a lot of space actually i know that the outlet bag looks a lot bigger but this one is very spacious now looking at the zipper you can see that it is still a plastic zip and it's also ykk and it also has the leather pull on the inside you have of course your care card and we have the creed here um, just gonna have a closer look okay one big difference is in the zipper is that at the end here you have a, re um, a reinforcement leather tip from the retail version while in the outlet version it's nothing there's nothing there to reinforce it so i think that's a plus for the retail because that that actually protects your zipper better um and it has it on both ends there as you can see and also in the retail version on the creed they have a contrast stitching while in the outlet version it is like the same color another big thing that i noticed is that around the opening of the bag is that you have this leather trim which will actually protect the bag when you're pulling stuff in and out of it while on the outlet version it's just straight into the lining there is no reinforcement at all it's just the stitching so i think that's also one of the reasons why because you're using more leather in the retail version that it could be more expensive all right so i think we've taken um as much as we can looking at a closer look of both of the items and i hope that this has helped to let you see what is the difference between the two thank you so much for sticking with me i know that this video is a little bit longer than usual but i just wanted to get into every detail as much as i can and i hope this has been informative to you to really see what are the differences between the outlet version and the retail version of coach bags all right Till the next one.